welcome back to Grapple Wars. Brought to you by Elevate Fightwear, Brighouse Leisure, Taylor Autos, and Robin Abbas Media. We have Paul Haynes of Gracie Barrett Leicester versus Elliot Boylan of IPC. Also, a really explosive a start. Very explosive start. Oh. Elliot and Paul doing a lovely job of locking excellent this triangle. Excellent posture, excellent posture, though, Beautiful from the IPC. Beautiful posture from Elliot there. That was there. brilliant defense, brilliant Really defense. good. I think it was a technical decision to pull guard. Again, we saw with the IPC lads, very, very heavy top pressure. The MMA gym, very experienced MMA gym, like I said previously. Um, and he's got Anna in his corner, which we know is a phenomenal grappler himself. So expect, expect high quality grappling. Absolutely, absolutely. Now, Paul has come from Gracie Barrel Leicester. He's actually come on his own with no corner team. And he's, he's driving, he's, he's, he's doing well. I, I've seen Paul compete before and he's, he's a very adept competitor. So I'm expecting fireworks from this match. Forget, guys, reach out to Elevate Fightwear for all your no-gi gear needs. A little bit of a lull in the action here. Elliot looking to pass that knee shield. Paul doing a nice job of controlling that head there, looking to set up a close guard again. He's shown that he's dangerous from there. He definitely needs to keep these elbows tight with Absolutely. these triangle yep. threats that we saw straight off the bat. Straight Absolutely. Off the bat. Elliot looking to clear that bottom leg there. He's going to look to weave inside, which is the right decision, and start to smash this knee shield. He's got a very good open guard game. Yeah, Paul doing a great job of guard retention. This is a really nice clash of styles. We've got a pressure guy versus the, the guard player. You really love to see it. Very good. Really good posture. That posture. I'm always telling the guys I coach and train with, you don't need to look at the guy under you. He's trying to sub you. Just get Excellent. the head up. Look up. Really good work here. Elliot doing a nice job of just mitigating these submissions. I'd like to see him to start to get some attacks off of his own. It does look like he's listening to his opponent's corner team here. He keeps looking over. <laughs> <laughs> very quiet match. Yeah, very, uh, very quite intense. Elliot again really doing just a nice job. Here. I'd like to see a hip switch here, perhaps. Maybe switch his hips and just look to clear that entirely. Yeah, we know that this IPC head pressure isn't nice. We yeah, saw we've it seen in the previous that match. Lovely use of oh, that. Oh, he might have a head and arm set up here. He's going to look to set up the back. back. Yeah, he's going to bring that height, and he excellent. gets it. Excellent. He gets the back. Elliot doing a great job here. He's looking to chase that head and arm. He's keeping his chest behind the tricep there so that Paul cannot bring his arm back in front. I'm having to stand up slightly to see what's going on here. Elliot looking calm and composed on the top there. Paul nice and relaxed, just pummeling those grips, and he spins through, looks to come out the back oh, door. Excellent. Great oh, what work. a fantastic really scramble. Really good scrambles there. Paul is not out of the woods here. Elliot's going to look to go for that belly down armbar, and we saw that earlier in the evening from the IPC gentlemen, that they love, a, they love an armbar. I can't see how deep the elbow line is in. Oh, Paul does a great job of freeing his elbow. Looks to backstep there, perhaps to enter into saddle. Elliot content to stand up. I'm expecting of to course. see another guard pull here. I, I, I agree. I think Elliot. And I think it's a wise decision. I, I agree. I he agree. Was very he, showed, dangerous. he showed that he's very dangerous from his guard. And we know that Elliot's from a brilliant MMA gym. Uh, and, and they're probably not the guys you want to wrestle and clinch with, perhaps. Absolutely not. I would be sitting down. Yeah, and, and he does. And, and he does. And he does. He sits. Lovely reverse Delaheva entanglement there to sweep. And he looks to turn through. This is something that you find. You can see the experience difference with these guys, like much more calm, composed. Yeah, absolutely. There's Both no like nerves. There's yeah. no jittery nerves. It's all business. Yeah, all business. absolutely. Even the scrappier scrambles, they're less energy. There's much more of efficacy of movement. Absolutely. You know? He's looking to hunt for legs Absolutely. I, I, I love hunting legs from reverse to labor. It's a very effective position. Elliot doing a really nice job of just mitigating that, though, keeping some wedges and frames in place. He He's keeping might, his he weight. might have this knee line here. Though. He might have the knee line, but I think Elliot's doing a good job of keeping his weight over that bottom foot, and it and just makes it harder if to... If we oh. know anything about MMA gyms, they've always got heavy hips. Absolutely. Now it's a grip fight here. Elliot really needs to get some weight over this foot because if uh, Paul can free this grip here, he could be in some trouble. He does a lovely job Excellent. of pulling that leg up, but he doesn't calm, want to set up into a triangle. Just, just great work from both gentlemen. Elliot, even though he was deep in a submission attempt there, just unfazed in his face, you can oh, see. Oh, hey, and almost, almost turned into some MMA. Keith, Keith, Keith needs to keep his hands up at all times. I know, absolutely. He nearly times. got Sanchai cartwheel kick there, did Keith. Uh, I, I, I don't know, I think I kind of kind of for him. Oh, I'm here Had for a bit him. of strike into the here uh, to proceedings. I'm not sure Paul would agree with us if we said I'd strike into the proceedings with an IPC gentleman, but... Oh, wow. 
This is a very tough one to call. I think on submission attempts, Paul is taking it so far. I think he's had the clearer uh, attempts at submissions. Has been looking to finish the fight. Lovely he's, use of that reverse Delaheva hook again. He's doing a great job of keeping these hips away. And as we saw from the previous IPC lads um, match, it's dangerous when they have heavy hips. Absolutely. So he's doing Just a very good job of using this open guard to keep this distance, keep Absolutely. these frames in. And then it's very hard for this IPC lad to settle. Elliot doing a great job of fighting these grips and pinning the legs. Just not really allowing Paul to get the entanglements that he wants. He's just controlling and keeping the hips um, elevated. But we saw this in the previous match. They're very good at making connections. Yeah, very absolutely. It's just, it's just, it's, it's, you know, simple posture control, really. I think. Absolutely. Oh, he's looking oh. for a go-go. Looking for a go-go platter. I doubt he'll get that without much positional control elsewhere. But what a great match so far. And this is going to be a tough one for Keith to call. <laughs> Going to be a tough one for oh, Keith to go. Lovely back step. Beautiful jiu-jitsu there. Now, actually, I said I said um, Paul is taking it before, but interestingly, we, you know, Elliot did have the back and things as well. The so positional control from the IPC. Said, yeah, match. again, it's unsurprising. Yeah. It's unsurprising. Keith choosing to reset them in the middle there, which we like. Uh, again, it can really ruin scrambles getting to the edge of the mat. You know, and uh, in a technical match like this, those those inches really make a difference, a, a world of difference. Look at this just like need a belly. Yeah. I think Paul briefly maybe considered a buggy choke or something there. I, I do, I do agree. Oh, excellent. Just lovely retention of the half excellent guard, phenomenal. nice. Wonder if Elliot's gonna look to maybe punch through for a Darce choke here. Yeah, he's punching through there, I think. It's hard to see on the angle. Oh, excellent. Elliot's uh, retention, he's just so awkward. Absolutely. He's always got a leg, he's always got a foot in your face, he's just always in your way. And he looks to just turn through again using that reverse oh. Delaheva hook. He turns through. He might have a toe hold here. He could have a solid attempt on a he toe might hold. Have a toe hold. No, oh Elliot, no, he's released it. He Elliot, did released a, it. Elliot did a nice job of using his far foot to kick that off there. And he's oh, gonna chase be careful the triangle. these triangles here. He's going to chase the leg again. Excellent. Really nice Excellent work. Excellent use of the triangle threat to go back onto the Absolutely. legs there. Absolutely. And he, he falls back onto it. I think that was the right decision. This is. This is, a, this is a real threat at this point. This Very is a good. real threat yeah. now. He could go belly down on that. Ooh. Elliot showing some nice flexibility there. Oh my. Oh my oh. word, lads. Great work. Really good. I'd have tapped 45 minutes ago to that. Yeah, one. to be honest, I, I just got a leg injury watching oh, that. Absolutely. Um, Aaron calling him for patience. Aaron A.B. calling for patient attack in there. Oh, this is a tough one for this judges is, to call, really Becky. Difficult. This is a tough one for the judges to call. He's looking for this head and arm again, but we know that that exposed the back last time. Absolutely. I if he's looking and he actually for that used position. That. Now, we can see that I, I actually think Paul is okay in this head and arm. See, he's got quite a bit of space, and he looks, yeah. he looks pretty calm, but he's going to look to use that to get the gift wrap, yeah, and, and he's going to look to pull him up and take the back. Now, a back take here could be really disastrous. We're late in the fight, and, and it's the thing Keith's going to remember. Absolutely. It's the thing Keith is going to remember. It's the last thing the ref saw. What a wow. tough match to call. Fantastic Great match. match. Regardless just a, just of who this goes through, this a is phenomenal a phenomenal, match. phenomenal display. Ladies and gentlemen, what about that fantastic technical action going all the way? Let's hear them up, these guys. Brilliant match, gentlemen. Brilliant match. Going the distance, we went to the scorecards. We have a very close decision. Your winner is in the red corner. I wouldn't have liked to be the one to call that. I would yeah. not have liked to be the one to call that. We saw a really good positional dominance from the IPC lad, but a lot of submission attempts with the leg locks from that red corner. Really so, good work. What a great match. Rematch. Rematch, guys. Rematch. We've got to go again.